I'm going to demonstrate the garter stitch. Garter stitch is where you knit every row. So every row is the same. I've started by casting on a few stitches just for demonstration purposes. I'm going to knit the first row, knitting all the stitches that I have already cast on. So you just do that until you get to the end of the row. And at the end of the row, you're just going to turn the work around and you're going to do the same thing. Knit every stitch. Now, you know I always start by slipping the first stitch. People ask me why I do that. It's because it makes for a much cleaner salvage edge. So you just, again, knit until you get to the end of the row. And keep knitting. And people always ask me, why do I knit the last stitch backwards? And that's because it twists the yarn around and it makes the stitch tighter and again makes for a nice even salvage. So we're going to start again by slipping the first stitch and knitting every stitch until we get to the end of the row. And again, knit into the back of the last stitch. Turn the work around. Start again with slipping and then knitting every stitch. The good thing about the garter stitch is that it's exactly the same on both sides. It's particularly good for scarves, blankets, pot holders, dish towels. It doesn't curl. It just stays the same. You can use any size needle and any size yarn. And you'll see it's the most elementary stitch in knitting because it's just knitting. So you can get an idea here of what it looks like when it's done. Side A, side B, exactly the same.